Okay, so um, as you can see here, uh, the, the vinyl cutter we have has three sets of rollers. Normally, you want as many rollers touching the print that you're doing um, as you can. They slide back and forth with just a little bit of... They should slide back and... There it goes. Um, with a, just a little bit of a wiggle, um, they get back and forth. The only thing you don't want is never put one of your rollers directly above the center point. Now, um, we normally use smaller sheets of paper, which is why all the rollers were pushed over. But to keep your material from binding up, you want as many rollers as you can um, touching your print. And again, just keep that one center roller out of the dead center. Okay, so I've got that set up. Um, the cut speed um, by default was set to 100 millimeters per second and the cut pressure was 300 grams and so um, if I reset this to the default but we found that this a slightly slower cut speed um, works great and we're not really noticing the difference um, but the quality was a little bit better um, I'm gonna show you a couple things in later videos where you use these other buttons but right now um, the reset but be button being lit up is actually the way it should be and we're gonna put this vinyl um, into the machine in the next video.